Hey friends, Megan Elizabeth from ByMeganElizabeth.com, founder creator of the She Makes Club, and I am coming out of my skin excited. I've been waiting for this for weeks. Um, I just got the amazing FedEx delivery guy to do a drop off of some really cool things. Um, it's matching. I can't wait to see how pretty it is together. So I just thought I would go live and unbox it with you. Um, this is 100% business. This is 100% a blessing. This is 100% um, something that I know not. Um, I, like it's it's just so cool. I'm so excited. So we have a brand new iMac that we get to unbox today and it's going to match the brand new Cricut Explore 3, which I'm pretty excited about. You know I've had Cricut machines since the very beginning of life with Cricut. I've, I had something like 20 some machines, I think it was 27. Um, at one point in time, most of them I have either given, donated, or sold um, since the beginning of Above Ruby Studio and She Makes Club, but I still have my Cricut Joy sitting over on my desk, use that constantly, and then I also have my Cricut Maker over here on my, on my table mate on the other side of my desk. So I thought, you know, how cool to have the Cricut Explore 3 that has all the new capabilities and features of the extended roll and the faster speeds and all of those different things but I still have the maker that gets to do all of the deeper cuts and all of the other fancy um, you know blades and the different things that the maker can do that the Explore can't um, but the new upgrades of the Explore with the longer cutting capabilities the matless cutting the speed cutting and to be honest the main thing that I use my crickets for and I've always used them for is either vinyl HTV, which is still vinyl, heat transfer vinyl, um, or pa paper crafting cardstock. I use it for my memory keeping and scrapbooking the most if I'm not doing something with vinyl or making a t-shirt or something along those lines. So really for me, the Explore is the perfect option. So, um, hey Brooke, hey Nancy, hi Jared. Hello guys, thanks so much for joining today. So I just wanted to unbox, uh, it just arrived, so I thought it would be fun to share the excitement um, and and get to it. So let's start with, let's, let's, ah, it's hard to know what to open first, hi Bethany. Um, we're going to start with the, the computer, I think. It's the new um, iMac, the M1 chip in mint green. Well, green. It's so I don't. Oh, it has the See, Mac does this right. They they really do know how to do this and do it well. All right, let's. It's so big. I'm so ex. Oh my goodness. It's so exciting. This is so exciting. Okay. set it up here. I don't even know for sure, for sure, where this is going yet. Um, my, my other, my other iMac and my, um, MacBook Pro that I've had for years, um, I was able to sell. So I'm thinking that they might go, it might go where that was, but I'm also thinking about switching some things up in here. Hey Lucy, hey Samantha. Okay, I don't even know which way to open this because it's, I don't want to mess anything up. <gasps> it like, okay, opening a new Mac is like opening a new Cricut. They both, Provocraft and Apple, know how to do this right. It's such an experience just to open the dang boxes. It's amazing opening both in one day, like I can hardly contain myself. I feel like such a dork, but it's such an experience. Like it opens all the way up. Okay. Uh, oh my goodness. It's so pretty. It is so pretty. Okay. Let's pull off the protective sleeves. I see from there. Oh my word, this green 
is gorgeous. Okay, wait, you still can't see it because we still have protection on top of protection. Oh my goodness. Look at that green. It's a darker teal on the back. Mint green in the front. This is beautiful. Alright, let's get all the extra. I'm surprised how light it is too. Well, not really. I mean, things just keep getting lighter and better and better with technology. Oh my goodness. I don't want to get any fingerprints on it. I don't want to get a single fingerprint on it. Look at those greens, guys. Isn't that beautiful? Okay. So gorgeous. All right, this is going to set up here. Let's see if I can get it behind me. All right, let me move this up. Eek, there it is. <laughs> All right, let's see what else is in the box. We have all the accessories, the cords. Oh my gosh, the power cord is even mint green. Look at this, look at this power cord. It's the roped cord, it's magnetic, and it's green. This is way cool. Hi, Linda, hi, Bertha. Thanks guys for jumping on today. I hope you're doing really well. The keyboard, we have the rest of the, the mouse. Let's take a look at the mouse that's green as well. Beautiful. The front is still white, which is fine. Bottom's green. We have the green lightning cable. So everything coordinates and matches in here. And ooh, such a thin, gorgeous wireless keyboard too. I didn't get the um, like extended keyboard. I just got the, the standard. Okay, so that's everything in the Apple box. Oh my. All right, here we go. We're going to jump over. I have some cool things with Cricut. We're going to jump on over and open up this experience. I'm going to tilt you guys back down. Hi, Marion. Okay. So we're just hanging out on the floor because it's just easier to do this on the floor than it is to try to have it up on the desk and unbox all these things. I'm definitely trying to figure out exactly what the setup is going to be for this. But, oh my word. Exciting. Okay, here it is. The new Cricut Explore 3. Faster, bigger cuts, longer cuts, more capabilities than ever before. The technology just keeps getting better and better. Um, in our world when it comes to crafting, creating, making, when it comes to videos and business and all of those things, it's just so exciting. So let's take a look here. Open it up. Again, Cricut does it well. They give such an experience just like Apple does. You were born creative. What it says right here on the box. You were born creative. Oh, same thing, same feels. The whole Cricut pack, the sample materials and the getting started materials, they include it all. This is, if you've never had a Cricut before or have never experienced the world of Cricut, um, I hope to be the one to introduce you and get you completely hooked and excited, uh, just like I have been for more than 13 years now, uh, since my very first Cricut expression doing amazing fun videos, YouTube channel, the whole nine yards. Um, it's something that I've, I've never gotten tired of. It's always been something that has um, kind of brought back, put life into perspective, whether um, it's processing through different things that have happened, whether it's just celebrating 
and making things that are gifts or for other people. Uh, the Cricut has just kind of always, always been there for me, part of my, part of my creativity and my journey. And I'm excited about this. Okay, so on the bottom is the cord. So it's just very simple power cord. And then this is the, the USB cord to be able to plug it in for updates or things like that if you need to. The um, Explore 3 is still uh, Bluetooth enabled, so you can use it with Design Space on your computer or on your tablet device. I'm just going to remove all this. Oh my word. Guys, matching computer and Cricut. Stop it. This is craziness and I'm so excited. All right. This is Beautiful. All right, we're gonna take all the all the protective coverings off. There's no dial, like pressure speed setting dial on this. This is all done within Design Space now, which I love. So it's a simple load, power button, start cut, pause cut, unload mat function. This is going to be the open. I'm gonna like, I'm gonna set it up on the desk so we can do a real open. That's what we're gonna do in a second. All right. It's beautiful though, isn't it? It's so pretty. All right, we're gonna set it up here. Just give me a second so you guys can take a good close look. Oh wow. How fun. How fun. You almost can't tell how like beautifully they match because of the sun coming in. And I love, like I can look out my window now. Let's see if I can get it, get you guys to see. When I look outside my window, I don't think it's gonna focus in on it. Um, I just see the beautiful sunflowers growing in that field now, which is just awesome. All right, we're gonna press, we're gonna press the little button here to open it up. Oh, the slow open. Oh, it's just, it's like magical. It's magical. I just need it to all sit out on my desk all the time because it's too pretty. And now that I kind of redid some of the things in here, I have bins that match, my table mate matches. Here, I'll show you. So right now, this is where my Cricut Maker resides. It's on my Spa Green Table Mate from QVC, um, which is great. I have my printer up here and all the things. So I have a workstation over here. And then this is typically where you see me do the videos from and my main crafting. I have my overhead camera goes up there on that bar. Um, I have all of my, my bins full of all the good stuff. Uh, my other camera and, um, <clears throat> that's kind of how that all happens and works out here. But okay. My tripod is now decided that it doesn't want to be balanced anymore so we'll give it a shot there all right oh, okay so opening it up this still has the magnetic bar here so you can keep your extra blades um, all the extra housing goes there it's a magnetic closure so it stays uh, really well and then this is great for you know extra pens or the spatula or anything like that typically I don't keep very much in there what had happened with my maker when I first got it years ago, and I can actually even show you, when I first got the maker when it came out, something that I did and made the mistake of um, was kind of put too much in here and it bent it somehow. So this now doesn't close completely, it like broke. So sometimes, like once in a great while, um, my mat will get caught in there and I just have to watch that. So um, it's fine, like it still cuts and everything else is fine. I just have to watch because the mat will get hung up on there sometimes. So I could probably like tape it down. I actually never even thought of that until just now. Just getting a piece of tape to hold it down, but I don't keep like anything in there anymore. I just keep some stuff here. And then I actually have the Cricut, um, the Cricut tool uh, organizer holder too. So that's really an easy way to take care of all that. So still has the two AV housing. So A for the score, um, for pens, for markers, for, you know, all those different tools that can go right in there. So like here, this is one of the, the score pens can go right in, still can use that. 
right into place. The fine point blade housing, fine point blade is still in there. You can see it comes with that fine point blade. So, hey, Sherry. Hey, Tina. Um, so that's all in there. It's a new updated carriage housing for everything. So it's going to be faster. Um, again, matless cutting. So with Cricut Smart Materials, I don't have to use my Cricut mat. It can just go in, feed through, and I will show you. This is one of the upgrades for the new Cricut machines. So this came as well. I just have the box over here. This is the roller holder for Smart Materials. So if you buy a Cricut roll of Smart Material, this is, this, is cool. this is one of, well, not one of, this is an amazing new feature. Um, so this goes on, it actually has a trimmer here, so you can trim off your materials. And then I'm not exactly sure how it even goes on here yet. I have to do a little bit of playing. I think it just goes on here, but I wanna make sure that I'm not doing anything wrong. I think it just sets on the, on the thingy thing. But don't take my word for that yet because I haven't I haven't played with it enough to know for sure. But I feel like that's all it does. We'll figure it out for sure. But basically it sets on here, it feeds in the smart material, and it holds the whole roll and it goes in and out. You can cut very long lengths for your, your vinyl, for your HTV, for t-shirts, for signs, for banners, for whatever it would be. So you're way less limited in your creativity. Um, and you're not using a mat, so it's going to allow you to cut wider also than ever before. So it's just such a really, really cool new, um, you know, not only is it beautiful, I mean, this is just beautiful together. <laughs> um, there's just so many things that make our creativity, um, business life more convenient, easier, faster, which, you know, I mean, I think that's what we all kind of want a little bit when we can, when we can take our creativity to next levels and have less limitations and, um, be able to do more. I think that's just, you know, the goal, isn't it? So that's what this is allowing to do. The iMac is going to work great with design space. I've only ever used my Mac with design space. Um, when I've tried to use my other, other things than my Mac, I was disappointed. I just felt like it wasn't as responsive and I got frustrated with it to be completely honest one of my favorite things to use with design space is actually my iPad um, I find that I have like the most creative control and it's just easy to create and make files on the go and then bring them home to the Cricut whether it's the maker the joy or the new Explore 3 um, I have so many options to be able to create with my cardstock with my vinyl with um, making t-shirts with doing wood signs with engraving with embossing i mean really the sky's so the limit with cricket if you if you didn't know that already from following um maybe you maybe you do now um and it's something that is worthwhile adding to your craft room for schools for your kids my kids love to create with the cricket too my daughter's constantly asking if we can go into the craft room and make something and spend time together which is always fun um, it's something that they've grown up around is the cricket machines <laughs> literally would have Jenna sit in her little bumbo boppy um, seat on the kitchen table next to me as I was doing cricket and even videos like this one um, it's kind of fun to look back at. It's so crazy. I mean, time just goes so fast. She's turning 13 this year. It's just mind blowing. Like, how does that happen? Um, cricket has been a big part of our family and our journey for a long time. So it's so cool to, uh, continue to watch them grow and expand with new technology to bring us new innovations. Um, I know we kind of talked about it before, but like when Benson had his, his car accident, it was so amazing that the Cricut team sent him a beautiful thing of uh, flowers and balloons while he was in the hospital. Um, that's how family Cricut has been for us um, for such a long, long period of time. So it's, it's exciting. Uh, the new technology is great with the longer, faster, all of that stuff. Of course, the machines keep getting prettier and prettier. I'm not gonna say the machines haven't always been pretty, but they have gotten prettier. Um, I remember when the purple one first came out and the yellow one and the red, ex um, the red expression came out. I was like all over the red expression. I actually still have my red expression. It's just in a closet at my parents' house. <laughs> but that red expression that had, that held a lot of miles, went a lot of places. Um, 
it's just cool. Anyway, so I wanted to be able to share that with you guys today. I thought it would be a fun little journey to open up and see and, and to check out. Let's open up. There's one other box that came from Cricut. So we'll open that one up. This is actually, um, I think this is stuff from their, when they had one of their sales. Um, I think it was just some extra, extra little things that were picked up in the process of the sale, but I will, yeah. So they had some infusible ink. That was this way. Hello, this way. Infusible ink, um, rainbow sheets. Wanted to kind of grab hold of, and then also this is Smart Sticker cardstock. So Smart Sticker cardstock, really cool. You can um, draw on it, cut on it. It's smart material, so it doesn't need a mat. It just loads in, and uh, I thought it'd be cool to have some of that stuff. So no worry about the mat, just load and go. And Cricut just keeps getting smarter and more innovative, and I just love them so much for it. So thank you, Cricut, um, for all that you do, for all that you are to be a part of our family for so many years, for helping us to expand our creativity, to uh, enjoy making inside our community of She Makes Club, to be able to tell our stories, to be able to process life, to be able to memory keep, to be able to work through all the things that life throws at us, to be able to just zone out, veg out, make together, enjoy life together. Uh, that's what Above Ruby Studio and She Makes Club has always been about. So thanks for joining me this afternoon. I really, really, really appreciate it. Um, I hope it was fun for you to kind of see some of the excitement of opening up new things like this because it's fun and it's an experience just to open them up. So if it's an experience that you've had for yourself or one that you want to have for yourself, tell me about it. Let me know. Uh, give me a comment. Send me a message. I love getting messages from you guys and being able to communicate with the community. So have an amazing, amazing day. Enjoy the moments. If you have any questions, let me know. And I do want to tell you one more thing real quick before I go, and I'm going to do a different video on this later, but since I have you here, um, one more important thing is there is a really cool paper craft summit coming up that I am teaching two different classes in. One is a scrapbook class and one is a solo wood shadow box class using the Cricut. So a lot of fun with that. We'll show some basics on how to cut, slice, weld, do all those things. If you're new to the Cricut family, if you're really unsure if it's been sitting in the box and you feel intimidated by it at all, I'd love to invite you to come take a look at the Cut With Confidence Crash Course to Cricut Design Space. It'll walk you through all the functions and the features in a quick and easy 11 module step-by-step -step program it's $11.97, so it's super affordable for anybody to be able to uh, get a hold of and go through an entire class on using your Cricut, especially with your iPad. I primarily use the Joy in that video, but it doesn't matter which machine. It's really focused in on how to use design space. So if you're like, what is weld? What is slice? What does this button do? How do I copy? Where do I make it? What do I whatever the question may be, um, I'd love for you to come check out the Cut With Confidence crash course because it can help. Um, it's I've helped over 100,000 women and men all across the world um, since, wow, so crazy, such a blessing, since 2010 uh, to be able to learn to master their cricket and expand their creativity and enjoy life's moments. So I'd love to invite you if you're new to come do the same or invite somebody that you know along for this journey too. We're not stopping anytime soon. I hope you guys have a great day. I'd love to see you for the Paper Craft Summit. Um, I will provide a link. The summit itself is free. There's VIP upgrades and all kinds of extra bonuses and fun things that you can do. So you can check that out. I will be posting that at bymeganelizabeth.com as well as across the social media channels as well and the video description uh, after the fact. So. Hope you have a great day. I'll see you soon. Bye-bye.